All right, so I'm in your app. It looks everything looks fine, right? So if I want really the one that's going to have to have the primary key or the foreign keys, is this transaction table, right? So I modify the table. I come over and let's just make this big. I got a pretty big monitor, so this should make this big. So I've got this one here, okay? Um, I can reset it to nothing, okay? The way you do it is you click on it and you pick the table you like and you pick the foreign key that it needs to be. So this is the foreign key for this. So the payee table, okay? And over here, you could do on update, on delete. So why don't we do that too? So we'll go on update, on delete. And that just means if I delete a payee, um, if I delete a payee here, it will delete all the transactions that have that payee here, okay? And if I come down here and click okay, it's not gonna work, okay? So let me just show you. So if I come down here, I click okay, I go back to modify table. Um, I make it big again. Oh, at least that's there. But that is not um, that is not the one. That was the one from before. Okay, that one that was already there. Okay, but you see, I was missing on delete. Let me just do another one. So we'll come up here to um, bank account ID. Okay, so we come over here, we pick bank, bank account, bank account ID. Okay, and then on update, on delete. Okay. What you have to do is click off it, but don't click in the white space. So if I click here, then it writes it. Okay. Same thing with down here. I want to put on update on delete. Okay. I click off it and then it adds it. And then when I click, okay, um, it says we're going to create this new table. There's a syntax error, most likely with this on update on delete thing. I, I have to go maybe Google how to do it. Um, but that's, that's the syntax here, right? So let me just, um, I think let's just, maybe that might work there. See if that, see if that works. Click. Okay. Nope. Still having a syntax error with that. I need to, I need to figure out how to do the on update on delete. I haven't done that part yet, but let's just get rid of that. And let's just get rid of that. And it will actually write those in there by clicking OK. And error checking foreign keys after table modification, the changes will be reverted. So it's saying that there was an error, OK? Most likely, you if you have data. So if you have any data in any of these things, see all of this data, you can't put data in until after you get um, so this right here, this transaction category ID should be a number. The payee should be a number. Bank account is an ID. It should be a number. Okay. So get rid of all the data out of here. Then create your um, your foreign keys. Okay. That's So that's what it's basically telling you. Like, oh, look, this is supposed to be an integer. It's not an integer. I can't make this an integer. Okay. So that should help. Um, Again, let me know if you have more problems. I can we, we can talk about it. Also, tonight we have office hours at 7:30. You could jump in there, or I can meet you anytime.